es muy común en inglés ya que el hablante los utiliza con mucha frecuencia para evitar la redundancia de palabras. Type 1 Conjunction Pronoun Auxiliary 2 And I do too. Examples Susan likes milk and I do too. He is hungry, and I am too. Sarah was at home last night, and Joe was too. Anne is hungry. ¿Reconoces este tiempo? Bien, la oración modelo nos dice que la persona conjuga con el verbo to be. Por lo tanto, hacemos uso de are is. Sarah was at home last night. Sarah was at home last night. Recuerda que was es el pasado del verbo to be. Quiere decir que esta es la forma base. Was, were. Type 2. So, auxiliary, pronoun. Type 2. So, plus, auxiliary, plus, pronoun. Examples. I am tired. So am I. I studied last night. So did I. Shirley can speak French. So can Carlos. Al igual, I do too son tipos de respuestas cortas que hacen mucho uso de los auxiliares. Linda, do you know how to get to Daniel's Co? I've never been there before. Are you driving or taking the subway? The subway. Right. Take the number 9 from West 72nd Street, get off at Times Square, and change to the shuttle. Go across town and get off at Grand Central Station. Go above ground and walk north on Park Avenue. Just a moment. Let me write this down. Take the number 9 from West 72nd Street, get off at Times Square, and change to the shuttle. Got it? Yes, thanks. Now, once I get to Times Square, which train do I take? Change to the shuttle, go across town, and get off at Grand Central Station. Go above ground and walk north on Park Ave. Can you repeat that? Change to the shuttle, go across town, and get off at Grand Central Station. Go above ground and walk north on Park Avenue. Thanks, Heather. How long does it take? It takes about a half an hour. When is your meeting? It's at 9. I'll leave 8.30. That's a busy time of day. You should leave at 8. Okay. Thanks, Heather. No problem. My friend Rich is coming to town next week. Have you met him? No, I haven't. No, oh, he's kind of crazy, but a great guy. Yeah. Why do you say so? What's he like? He's really hard working, but very much a loner. He's pretty talented. He can do just about anything. Sounds interesting. Is he married? No, he isn't. What does he look like? Maybe my friend Alice would be interested in meeting him. <laughs> He's tall, slim, and quite good looking. I'm sure your friend would find him attractive. What's she like? She's outgoing and very athletic. Really? What sports does she like playing? She's a great tennis player and also goes bicycling a lot. Mm, what does she look like? She's kind of exotic looking. She's got long black hair and piercing black mm, eyes. People think she's rather beautiful. Mm, do you think she would like to meet Rich? Sure. Why don't we hook them up? Wow, this gym is great! What a fantastic workout! Yes, I like coming here very much. What other sports can you do? Well, I can play tennis, I can do a little karate, and I go windsurfing in the summer. You're very fit. I can't do many sports. I like coming to the gym because the exercises are easy. Listen, I have an idea. Why don't you come to karate class with me? No, I can't do karate. But you can learn. Karate is a great sport. How about coming with me on Saturday? Well, okay. Great. Why don't we meet at my house at 10 in the morning? Sure, that's a good idea. By the way, what other hobbies do you have? I like going to the cinema and reading a little. Do you like cooking or baking? No, I can't cook. I'm a horrible cook. Oh, I love cooking. I tell you what. Why don't I cook lunch after karate class? Now that's a great idea. 
Okay, karate and lunch on Saturday. It's a date.